In this video, let us look into what is circular system of measurement of angles. And in this system, the, the unit of measurement is radian. Well, uh, we will see in a short time what is meant by radian and, and how do you define radian. Well, uh, here we've got the definition of what is a radian. One radian written as uh, 1 to the power of small c is the measure of an angle subtended at the center of a circle. Here is the measure of this angle, angle AOP or angle POA, uh, which is subtended at the center of the circle by an arc equal to the length of the radius of the circle. So whenever there is an angle formed, all right, so whenever there is an angle formed in a circle, such that the radius of the circle, the radius of the circle in this case is OA and as well as OP, right? Because uh, any line that joins the center of the circle to the circumference is the radius. Therefore, the radii in this case are OA and OP. So now if OA and OP are equal to the arc PA, right? If it is equal to the arc PA, then the angle subtended at the center is equal to one radian. This is how you define a, a radian and the unit of measurement as far as the circular system is radian. That is, whatever you measure is written in terms of one radian or two radian or three radian or whatever it is. So in this case, the measure of angle AOP, the measure of one radian or rather the definition of one radian is that this angle AOP measures one radian if the arc PA is equal to the radius OA. Now, if the arc PA is twice or if it is double the size of the radius OA or OP, then what do you think will be the measurement of the angle? It will be two radians. If it is three times the radii OA and OP, it will be three radians and so on. But to define one radian, well, if you want to define one radian, this is the definition. That is that the measure of the angle sub subtended at the center of the circle by an arc of length equal to the radius of the circle. So whenever an arc is equal to the radius of a circle, then the angle subtended at the center is equal to one radian and so on. So this uh, concludes. This is a quite a simple concept, not a very complicated one. So this is the third and the final uh, system of measurement of angles. This is called as a circular system of measurement of angles. So this uh, concludes this video. So I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with uh, more concepts based on measurement of angles.